if there's no road to where you're going build one so you guys we got the engine hoist over here at the donor vehicle that can only mean one thing we're getting ready to yank this lm4 out of this trailblazer because we've got parts ordered and we're gonna start going hard on the firebird and see if we can't get the uh, lm4 in that 99 firebird stay tuned
I don't know if you guys have ever pulled the engine out of one of these friggin' trailblazers before. I suggest don't. Uh, most of it was done for me before I bought this thing from the guy that I bought it from. It's still, it was a pain, pain in the butt. Uh, I am no professional by any means, but I will tell you that was not fun. Uh, as you can see, it's stupid heavy. Um, I just felt that it was easier to pull it that way than it would be to try and get to those transmission bolts up top. So I yanked the whole thing out and I had to uh, hook my truck up to the trailblazer and then gently pull it backwards and then you saw in the video where it would lift the back end of the engine hoist up and then I would step on that with my fat butt and yank the thing out and I hope that I didn't damage anything when it tipped over uh, I don't think that I did but hopefully I mean I'm going to tear the thing apart just to make sure that it's all good anyway so hopefully it's all good uh, so next video hopefully we'll be tearing this thing down and cleaning it up uh, I've got parts that have come in. I've got my hooker motor mount adapters uh, My oil dipstick and tube um, the torque converter adapter plate and One other thing. Oh the alternator relocation bracket is in so Hopefully I can keep going on this thing and we'll see how it turns out. Thanks for watching guys. Until next time, peace and I'm out.